The DevExpress ASP.NET charting engine supports an unlimited number of data series. In this video, we're going to add two data series to an ASP.NET chart. One bar series showing Microsoft Annual Revenue, and one line series showing the summation of the Microsoft Annual Revenue. So let's take a look. Let's start with an empty ASP.NET application and add a new web form titled 2D bar and line.aspx. Let's navigate to the DX 10.2 data section in the toolbox. Then drag and drop the web chart control onto the newly added page. Let's set the width of the web chart control to 600 pixels and the height to 400 pixels. Open the Tasks dialog and click Run Wizard. Bar is selected by default, so click on the Series tab. We're going to draw a chart showing Microsoft's revenue for the years 2000 through 2004. Series 1 should already be set to Bar. Rename Series 1 to Annual. Click on Series 2 and set it to Line. Let's rename Series 2 to Summary. Click on the Data tab on the left. And now you can see the data has been inserted. Now click on Point Labels on the left and change the Resolve Overlapping Settings mode drop-down to Default. Now we're going to add Axis Titles. Click on Axes on the left. By default, the drop-down should say Primary Axis X. Click the drop-down and choose Primary Axis Y. Choose the Elements tab on the right and check the visible checkbox. Let's set the title text to Revenue in Millions. Now the last thing we're going to do is set the chart title. Click on Chart Titles on the left. On the right, click the Add button. Change Chart Title to Microsoft Corp Annual Revenue. Now you can build the project and execute it to check the results. Thanks for watching, and of course, thank you for choosing DevExpress.